Sabrina Silva with Katie Marimba and I want to say hello and Merry Christmas and Happy New Year uh, for those of you who are who have instrument ensembles similar to marimbas or if you have marimbas on your own I wanted to show you some warm-ups that I use to help uh, beginners to help intermediate players and even some advanced players something to get everybody on the same page right now I have uh, an intermediate level group it doesn't mean that we don't do beginner warm-ups I do start off with a very simple warm-up I typically do three two to three warm-ups in the beginning it takes about five ten minutes of their time I find warm-ups very very helpful a chance for their brains to get uh, ready for what we're about to uh, have in that rehearsal so I'm gonna break it down break this into a series of three videos first one is going to be a beginner level it's gonna be a level one so this is for those of you who have beginners um, or if you're teaching a teaching a xylophone type instrument or a marimba in your classroom this is a fun way to get your students engaged and ready to learn a song if you're new to my channel my name is Sabrina Silva and I'm with Katie Marimba and you can find more information about my group classes that I offer um, at www.katiemarimba.com you can also go on Facebook and look for me there I post um, stuff regularly on there as well we just featured our last concert for 2019 I'm also on Twitter uh, at Katie Marimba that's our Twitter handle this is the Katie Marimba channel it's not only for it to feature concerts that uh, my groups perform but it's also to feature teaching videos to encourage my fellow music teachers out there anyway I hope you enjoy this video I hope it's very helpful and if you need to reach out for me just leave a comment below or you can contact me at my email address silvasing75 at gmail.com enjoy the video excuse me all it is is a say and play. So I'm gonna say a pattern going up the scale on each letter and all you have to do or all your players have to do is repeat the pattern. So it goes like this. So I'll say C, 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 C. D, 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 D. E, 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 E. F, 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 F. G, 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 G. A, 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 A. B, 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 B. C, 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 C. And then going back down, I'm gonna just keep it very simple. We're gonna tap each note coming back down three times. So it's gonna be C, C, C. Okay, for this next warm up, we're gonna hold our mallets like a microphone. We're gonna hold it right here. And I want you to say tippy tippy ti ti ta. Let's all say it. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. Do it again. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. Again. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. More time. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. Okay, so now what I want you to do is I want you to whisper it and I want you to see if you can get your mallets to move at the same time with the sounds that you're making with your mouth. So like this. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. 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 All right, you don't want them moving on their own. Remember, you control the mallets. The mallets do not control you. All right, so one more time. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. Okay, so now it's time to go to the marimba. Now we're ready to actually play. So the goal is to actually be able to play tippy tippy ti ti ta with everyone else in the group at the same time. Tippy tippy ti ti ta. Ready, set, here we go. Tippy tippy ti ti ta to the D. To come back down, back to the big C, we're not just gonna jump there, we're actually gonna work backwards. We do C, 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 B, 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 A, 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 and so on. All right, so here we go. Ready, set, here we go. C, 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 B, 
A. Our final warm up for this, playing up the scale and back down the scale. We actually have to play it together as a group. We were staying together. We all started on this big C together and we all stopped on this big C together. Here we go. Now let's go back down. Ready, set, here we go. Good. Now, now, if you're sitting there trying to be a hot shot kind of player and thinking that, well, I can do this in my sleep and I can play fast, yeah, that's not what we're going for. We're trying to see if we can stick together. So let's try it again, all right? We're gonna try it a smidge faster. Let's see if you can do it. Ready, set, here we go. This time, I actually do want you to play with both mallets, both hands, back and forth. That's gonna help you stay together with the rest of the group. So I'm gonna try it one more time, same speed, but this time if you were not using your two mallets, go ahead and use them now. Give it a shot. Maybe you may discover something new about yourself. Here we go, and. Okay, so those are my warm-ups for my beginners, and I hope you enjoyed the video. This is Katie Marimba. If you liked this video and you found it helpful, please uh, like and subscribe, because I do plan on um, putting out a second video for your intermediate players. Again, if you wanna check out my group lessons and see what I offer, uh, because I use these in my group lessons all the time, go to www.katiemarimba.com, and I look forward to seeing and hearing from you guys. Enjoy.